And my, oh, actually, you know what? Going back to the original question, how I got into collecting, my mate across the road, his dad was a huge collector. He had, a, he had back in the, in the 80s, he called it a den. And he had this den and it was his office, wall to wall of glass display cabinets of different figures, um, cars, models, everything, right? That's what got me into collecting. I was just like, wow, this is awesome. Yeah. Anyway, his, he collected Star Wars. And I went there with my tub one day and he goes, oh, do you want to sell them? I was like, yeah, I want to buy these wrestling figures. And he goes, hmm, I'll give you $60 for all that tub. And I remember in my in my mind thinking 60 bucks will get me two tag team sets from the Hasbro line, which was um, – and I got Bushwhackers and Demolition. And, um, yeah, he, he paid me 60 bucks. I gave him a whole ice cream container full of Star Wars figures, went home and told mum my mum lost them. Like she had the shits because she knew that – those figures were worth worth more than sixty bucks. But anyway, long story short, I got my Hasbro's. I was more happier, and I'm still got them today. Mint condition, mint condition. That is awesome. Uh, all right, so this is our last question from our um, 2020 no 2020 member of the year, Bradley Perryman. Thoughts on figs down under trading cards, <laughs> and why would I be the first card in the set with auto variants? <laughs> Uh, look, uh, some of the things we do on the pod are similar to the major pod, uh, but uh, we will not be going down the trading card path. <laughs> and if there's anyone who's going to be the trading card number one, it will not be Brad Perryman. <laughs> you know, it'd be you know, it would be cool though, a Christmas calendar or something, something Christmassy that we, you know, a bit of a novelty uh, Christmas calendar of uh, the figures down under members. I'll have to uh, start going to the gym if that's the case. Ah, oh, mate. Bigger the better. What, what would you be? What would you be, Mr. Mr. September? Mr. July, mate. That's when my oh, birthday is. I'd be Mr. Mr. March. July. I'd also be Mr. January as well because uh, one month's never enough. <laughs> boom, boom. Well, mate, what was your favourite question? You can choose the winner. I reckon Steve Marmons. I reckon uh, good question there at the end. Um uh, about and he said happy birthday, which is nice too. So, uh, there you go. Much with Steve. good work, buddy. Um, and we'll take your pick of the figs and let us know. And we'll pass it on to Jeff. Congratulations, Steve. Well done. You've just won yourself a series 88 elite figure. Take your pick, send me your um address, and I'll pass it on to Jeff from Go Figure Collectibles. Well, that is the final segment of the show, mate. Ready to wrap up? I'm ready to roll. And you know, uh, I reckon. We're getting very close to our first birthday. Yes. So this is episode 21. We've got five more to go. But we did have a, a break over January, so I wonder if we've actually gotten close. What do you mean? We had a couple of weeks where we didn't do a pod. But you'd go, you'd go, you'd go from the episodes, wouldn't you? No, you go from the date of the first episode. You can't go from the uh, the amount of episodes. You don't count the 26 and say that's a year. The 26, 26 episode would be a full year, half yeah, every Yeah, but quarter. what about the four weeks in January we didn't do an episode? But I don't know. I don't, I don't know if I count that. So I you're do. telling me that if your birthday is the 31st of January, but then yeah. for some reason that you're in another country for a few weeks, you don't count that part of the year because you weren't here? No, but I'd celebrate my birthday. You've <laughs> lost the plot. You've <laughs> lost the plot. <laughs> Oh, it's, mate, it's pretty late over here. Anyway, let's wrap up the show. Thank you, everyone, so much for supporting the show. Thank you to everyone that has uh, left us a five-star review and given us all the sorts of uh, thumbs up and follows and all the all the good stuff. We really, really appreciate it. If you haven't done so, please take the 30-second it, it takes to do. It helps us get the show out there. Uh, check us out on all our socials, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, YouTube. And we have been a little bit slack with our social media. I must admit I put my hand up. I've just been that busy. Uh, but I will start um, focusing on that a little bit uh, more down the track. But always use the hashtag, the hunt never ends, because you know why, mate? Never ends, James. It never ends. And I, and I keep proving that theory. God damn it. <laughs> Thank you once again, all. We'll see you all in the toy aisles. Have a great week. See you soon, everybody. Thanks for listening. <laughs>